Once upon a time, a long time ago, there lived two happy people, Mom and Dad, and they had two children, Mary and Miranda. To understand how happy they were, you have to understand how things were in those days. You see, in those days, everyone was given a small, soft bag of fuzzies when they were born. Anytime a person reached in this bag, he or she was able to pull out a warm fuzzy. Whenever somebody was given a warm fuzzy, it made him or her feel warm and fuzzy all over. People who didn't get warm fuzzies often were in danger of getting sick and dying. When I was young, it was easy to get warm fuzzies. Anytime somebody felt like it, they might walk up to you and say, I would like to have a warm fuzzy. You would then reach into your bag and pull out a warm fuzzy the size of a child's hand. Here, Mary. Oh, Mom, look at the little fuzzy now. It's so happy because it knows that I already love it. I want one. <laughs> look how it snuggles up close to me. <laughs> I will give each of you a bag to share with your friends. There were always plenty to go around. Everyone felt warm and fuzzy and happy most of the time. But one day, a bad witch became angry because everyone was so happy and no one was asking her for help. This witch was very clever and she thought of a very wicked plan. One beautiful morning, the witch crept up to dad while mom was playing with the children. See here, dad, look at all the fuzzies that mom is giving to the children. You know, if she keeps it up, she's going to run out of them and then there won't be any left for you. Do you mean to tell me that there isn't going to be a warm fuzzy in our bag every time we reach into it? Absolutely not. And once you run out, that is all there is. You don't have any more. <laughs> Dad believed what the witch told him and began to notice every time Mom gave a warm fuzzy to somebody else and got very worried and upset because he liked the warm fuzzies very much and did not want to give them up. Ma, be careful about the way you give away your warm fuzzies. Why, Dad? There's going to be a shortage. A shortage? Because Mom liked Dad so much, she stopped giving warm fuzzies to other people as often and kept them for him. The children watched this and soon began to get the idea that it was wrong to give warm fuzzies any time you asked or felt like it. They, too, became very careful. They would also watch their parents closely, and whenever they felt that they were giving too many fuzzies to others, they began to feel sad, even though they found a warm fuzzy every time they reached into their bag. They reached less and less and became more and more stingy. People became unhappy and felt less and less fuzz. Some even got sick and died because they didn't have love. More and more people went to the witch for help, but they still were not happy. The situation was getting very bad indeed. The bad witch, who had been watching all this, did not really want the people to die. I have another plan. I will give everyone a bag that looks like a fuzzy bag, except that this one is cold while the fuzzy bag is warm. Inside of this bag are cold pricklies. These cold pricklies will not make people feel warm and fuzzy, but will make them feel cold instead, but they will not die. I want a warm fuzzy. I can't give you a warm fuzzy. But would you like a cold and prickly? Please give me a warm fuzzy. No one was happy. I don't want to play. I wish I had more warm, warm fuzzies. The situation got even worse. There were less and less warm fuzzies around. So warm fuzzies, which used to be the thought of as free as air, became extremely valuable. Children were becoming selfish and would only give the fuzzies to their very best friends. What did you do to my warm fuzzy? I gave it away. You what? Get it back. I will give you two dollars for a warm fuzzy. No, I might not have enough. Besides, you cannot buy fuzzies. Here, you can have one of these. This doesn't feel soft and warm. It makes me feel cold. Me too. Why do we feel so bad? Because there aren't enough to go around. There were loads of fuzzies. What happened to them? You know, fuzzies are something like love. 
The more you share, the more you give back, the more you have to share. Not long after this, a good angel heard about the shortage. I hear that you're running out of warm fuzzies. We We are. are. Can Can you you help help us? us? Well, sure. I've brought bags of warm fuzzies with me. Take all you want. But remember one thing. Don't keep them, but give them away. Share them with everyone. I'm so happy that we have so many fuzzies again. It makes me feel like singing and dancing. Could we sing Pocket Full of Warm Fuzzies? Yeah. Sure. Now that fuzzies have come back to Fuzzy Town, what about your fuzzies? Are you ready to share them with everyone? I got a pocket, I got a pocket full of warm fuzzies. I got a pocket, yeah. yeah.